We are working new developments tonight in the Aaron Hernandez murder trial. Today, the girlfriend of Odin Lloyd, who's also the sister of Hernandez's fiance, wrapped up her testimony following several days on the stand. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell joins us now live from Fall River Superior Court with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom. While well, Shania Jenkins was on the stand, her sister Cheyenne was in the courtroom listening very closely to all of that testimony, even taking notes during some of it. After Odin Lloyd's body was discovered, his girlfriend Shania Jenkins went to see her sister Cheyenne and Cheyenne's fiance Aaron Hernandez. While Shania was on the stand, we saw surveillance video of the sisters hugging. Remember yesterday, Shania testified that Hernandez also tried to console her. She was asked about that again today during cross examination. I believe he said, I've been through this death thing before. It will get better with time. But the defense tried to refute that line using Jenkins' grand jury testimony. You said, I believe he said that he's been through this and that it will get better with time. Yes. That was your testimony in the grand jury? Yes. And is that still your testimony? I'm, I believe there may have been a couple words, but that's the gist of it, yes. The prosecution also showed a series of surveillance photos from inside Hernandez's home. Shania is wearing a white shirt. Cheyenne is on the right-hand side of your screen. You indicated that you had um, observed your sister at some point going to the basement with an item. Yes. And what was that item? A black trash bag. Early on in the case, investigators said Cheyenne destroyed evidence from the basement. She's facing a perjury charge accused of lying to the grand jury. While we were watching the video of Shania and Cheyenne Jenkins hugging, you could see Cheyenne wiping away tears from her eyes in the courtroom. Coming up new at 6, Odin Lloyd's mother takes the stand. Live in Fall River with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News. Now Aaron Hernandez on trial. The prosecution called more witnesses today. Odin Lloyd's girlfriend finished her testimony, after which his mother took the stand. Now, she's been in court since the trial started, but has left the room more than once after becoming overwhelmed with emotion. New at 6 tonight, we're hearing what she had to say. From the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell is outside Fall River Superior Court. The judge told Odin Lloyd's mother she had to keep her emotions under control in front of the jury. She was able to hold it together as she looked at several photos of her son and even as she identified a photo of his body at the medical examiner's office. In the snapshots, it's all smiles for a night out at a club. There's one photo of the guys, Aaron Hernandez in the middle, Odin Lloyd all the way to the right. There are also photos from the inside of a party bus. This shows uh, Mr. Hernandez on the right. Correct. And Odin on the left. Correct. The defense used these photos trying to prove Hernandez and Lloyd were friends, Correct. spending lots of time together with other friends and family. Uh, and, and basically, during those visits, uh, a typical pattern would be that Aaron and Odin would hang out and you would hang out with your sister or other family members. Yes. And uh, some of the activities that Aaron and Odin would do would be to smoke marijuana. Correct. Did it appear to you that they were enjoying each other's company? Yes. Remember, during the defense's opening statement, attorney Michael Fee argued Hernandez had no reason to kill his friend. But when Odin Lloyd's mother, Ursula Ward, took the stand, she testified her son and Hernandez were not friends. Did you know um, any of Odin's friends? Yes. Okay, and um, did, he, did he ever have friends to the house? Yes. They have quite a few friends. Okay. Did you know Aaron Hernandez? No. Had you ever met him before? No. Had he ever come to your home? No. The defense had no questions for Lloyd's mom. A North Attleboro police captain was called to the stand this afternoon. We expect his testimony to resume tomorrow. In Fall River with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.